Hello, we're in Malta and we're going to talk about a oil by Sylvia Halliday. This is really a video about the frame more than the picture. So Sylvia Halliday, S-Y-L-V-I-A, H-A-L-L-I-D-A-Y. Sylvia Halliday, British artist who was in Malta for a long time. So there's another video about the actual picture and since we bought the picture, it's been restored and any flakes have been put back on and without having completely sanitized it and euthanized it and, and de decharacterized it, this is a really lovely condition now. The nails on the side of the, of the canvas are rusty and we've left them with that sort of oxidey, rusty tone. The challenge here was to frame it conventionally, you lose part of the canvas and the signature becomes pinched to, into the corner. It wouldn't be obscured, but it would be pinched into the corner. So I thought I would do it a different way. We happen to have some frames I bought locally at a dealer in Nashar. And though the frame, this frame is probably later than the picture, this is very much the look people are after at the moment. This is not the sort of frame you can go and order in a shop because the sides are made of aluminium and the countersunk screws and the mitres are, are really well done. This is handmade out of extruded aluminium and it's what we were calling a, a marine quality fitting. The gaps are so accurate. And the frame wraps around the sides so it's not just a flat piece of metal, it's a proper moulded piece of aluminium. Uh, it's not foil and it's not silver colour, it's solid aluminium. And it's not anodized or, or painted or varnished, it's raw aluminium. And I would say that the frame is going to be probably 1970, 1965, 1970, and I think this is going to be 10 years earlier. But it's, it works quite well because the linen the original linen with this frame has this dirty reddy colour and it goes in quite well, not perfect, but it goes in quite well. Um, we put this in this central piece, this is new, this is linen in a beige or yellow or cream and that goes in well. So I think it's absolutely fantastic. It's not too large, it's distinctive, it looks like the sort of thing that could, it, it, perhaps could have been in those days. The back shows you the original backing board. It shows the Fomex liner, which has the cream linen on, the cream card on, which is made of cloth. It shows the painting and the stretcher of the painting. And because it's an oil canvas, it would be hideous just to cover it up. And because the canvas has been painted on the back of another painting by Sylvia Halliday, and it's been relined in a, in a sort of certain, certain way, we thought it was part of the story to have it showing. And it's attached with four screws on the edge of the stretcher so you can see as much of it as you can. So that's the, the reason it's, it looks so strange. That's what's going on in the back. And that we need to find a hanging hook of some sort at some stage. So this picture, it's painting this oil on canvas, is a, a mid 20th century English painting, painting of a scene in Malta, a social scene, and it's probably Flor probably Floriana because the artist lived in Floriana for 20 years. And the thing that it depicts is a, is a uh, totally Maltese crowd of people. Uh, that's that's uh, quite perhaps nearly gone now as a, as a demographic thing. So I hope that's been interesting. It's an example of, of a frame being reused and uh, this effect of an old frame with the old picture, I would say is, is fantastic. That's the Sarah Malta. Thank you very much.